All right, so right now we're making music for one of our like worlds in our game. Uh, Neil tasked me with making a song that kind of loops, whatever. Uh, <laughs> and I got, I don't know what my inspiration was. Like, I guess it was Muse or something. If I'll, I'll play the song for you guys. Um, and I played it for Neil and <laughs> he, he was like, dude, it reminds, I'll play the song now. <laughs> And then, so you, you just heard it, and then Neil uh, hit me with like that, the screaming man meme, I'll put that in now. Um, um, so I don't know, it was very funny. It was one of the funniest things ever. Cause I like, this, we're trying to make it similar to like Tetris Effect. Have you heard the song, The Deep? Uh, if you haven't, you should check that out. It's like an incredible song. Uh, we're going for that vibe and uh, I don't think I executed super well. I made a good song, but I didn't make the right song. All right, Neil, what are you doing right now? <laughs> You're being yeah, filmed. Uh... All right, well, I'll tell him. So Neil had the bright idea that he's gonna go for the world record. <laughs> world, world record. <laughs> uh, the a record is a record. <laughs> <laughs> the world record. For women <laughs> aged 40 to 49. That's the goal. The stretch goal is the world record for women. Which, which is, is 131, one, right? 132. 132. Okay, so that's you heard that. That's, that's yeah. pro strong women. My, my best 500 is probably 140. So Neil's going for I don't know how to do a custom. 132. Um, so yeah, I mean, uh, I'm not gonna take you through this process. It's the stupidest thing we've ever done, but I'll let you know how it goes and I'll, maybe I'll show you a glimpse of it. Oh, dude, it's not on. Oh, God damn it. Hey, it doesn't even count. No, no, it doesn't. This time on difficulty 10, we're doing it. You gotta reset it to 500. Yeah, it's annoying because I can't save it. That is annoying. So I have to hit a new workout, single distance. <laughs> Come on! Alright, you did it. You, you did it 130 That's so hard. Yeah, dude. That's insane. We should get locked here. Uh, let's just, uh, hide on 7B, 2, 3, 4. Okay, I think we got it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Alright, so I'm like three days post-surgery. The pain just kind of went away yesterday. No, I think I'm four days. It went away on day two at the end of the day. Um, now I'm just slinging for the next five weeks. Neil's here. Uh, washing the bikes, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. I think he's gonna work. He's gonna work on his bike a little and then ride. Nico. Nico. What are you gonna ride? Yeah. There is oil everywhere. That's true. 
like, yeah. I don't even know how it gets on my number plate. Maybe it's not oil. It might be splashing up in here. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I mean, that's oil. No, I'm making a bad joke. Also, as a little update on my bike. So I called them after like two weeks of radio silence. I had an appointment. I drop it off. They don't even like talk to me. They're like, leave your bike here. We'll call you in a week. A week goes by, nothing. Two weeks goes by, I call. They say that there's uh, an issue with my fuel pump and with the diode that switches my mappings. Um, so I'm like, okay. Uh, and then they say it might not be under warranty. They're gonna see what they can do. If they can even get Yamaha to pay for the pi the parts. The labor was still gonna be something I had to pay for. Uh, and I, at this point I'm like injured and I'm like, I don't, I don't even care anymore. They can just keep the bike. Uh, and then my dad called a week after that, after my surgery, and he talked to a guy that actually uh, had manners and, and knew how to speak to people. And um, the guy said that they're gonna try to get apart, but there like might be a recall on the fuel pumps, which is what was like mainly broken on my bike. So they're gonna try to get their hands on one, but it might be two months, because there might be, again, a recall on it. Uh, so now I'm just waiting. They said they'd pay for it though, which is cool, so. Um, Motorsport and it would not take months well I think I I've think never had a stock part take months right dad said that they might have recalled all the all of them all the OEM ones because they're bad yeah. in either case um, the guy we talked to most recently was actually like a cool guy and he's gonna try to get us our, my bike back as soon as possible so um, hopefully by the time I'm healed in like multiple months I'll have my bike back Ooh. So I don't think you can see him now, but if you look very carefully, if you listen very carefully, you can hear two guys who stand no shot at climbing this hill. Let me zoom out with one hand. It's not, it's not easy being uh, one-armed uh, in any capacity. Um, I gotta do this for like months. I don't, I have no idea. Oh, there's a glimpse of a man through the trees. Dang, I'm in a, I'm in the wrong spot. I'm at the top, but if I go up just a few. Well, my dad, his bike was facing down the hill and he's not on it. So I think, I think we missed some good stuff. What happened? What, what happened? Oh, we got a little, uh... He flipped it. That's great. Oh boy. You're like there, this looks easy now. I could like, if this wasn't here, it'd be.
Stand up and just yawk it. What? Stand up and stand, you know, and it's just really loose. give her hell. Yeah. You want to try in a different spot? <laughs> yeah. Where do you want to go? Do that a couple more times. I don't know. Yeah, that's how they do it in Erzberg too. They just, uh... <laughs> All right. Let's go. We have relocated to the other side of the property. It takes me about a half hour to drive across the freaking thing in the Pioneer because it hurts and I don't want to screw up the, the surgery because uh, I, I, I don't have the mental fortitude to do that. I don't know what I would do if that happened. So, taking it easy. This is not even taking it easy. That's the stupid part. I don't know what he's doing, but I'm cold. I don't know what he's doing. That was the lamest thing I've ever seen in my life. What's up? Oh, I was saying let's go that way. Okay, I thought you were gonna do this. Well, while there, I walk. there's literally no way. You can't even go around the log. You have to go up okay. to where the mountain bike trail connects. Yeah, okay. So Neil was saying this trail has a lot of tree action. There's, is that Bigfoot? Sasquatch? Bigfoot side. <laughs> but like four trees have fallen in the last six months, apparently. Honestly, the last like four months. But All right, Neil's going to try this. Oh boy. Oh, that was fancy. That was pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool, huh? That was pretty good. That was cool. Yeah, it was, it, the traction's really good now. I I could tell. Because I didn't really have a great run. Yeah, you, you ripped it too. And there's kind of a kicker at the top too, so it's easy to get over it. Oh, I see. Ugh, get my leg over this thing. Judo kick. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Nothing like a YZ250.
All right, so I got the camera back. Uh, Neil's just gonna do some laps on this little turn track thing, uh, and then we're gonna call it a day. Uh, Neil's back on his bike. fast because this is like you can't really tell which is even scarier but it's all rocks this is all rocky rocky crap <laughs> That was how the first lap should have gone, but didn't somehow. Uh, this is kind of scary, honestly. Oh, really? Oh, well, it's so, it's ice. Oh. That first lap, you took that so well. The jank turn right here. Yeah, well. it's because you can't see the rocks. Yeah, so you just kind and of And you forget. just kind of put your weight on your outside. Hey, yeah. you know. That's that's practice. Kind of works. All right, All right what can I try here? That's cool. Nothing. There's nothing cool to be tried. It really isn't. Woo! Sketchy. Trying to get one clip here. Just get one. Just do one clip here. I can't. I can't even believe what I'm witnessing right now. Oh my god, this is this is hard to watch. It's just hard to be a part of this. What are you doing? Oh my god, I'm gonna I'm gonna walk home. What are you doing? Oh my god, I'm done. Yeah, what you did out there today. It was just crazy. All the, the those turnaround <laughs> things. Wow, it was really incredible to watch. It was a marvel. Alright, well I'm going inside. We got her parked back where she belongs. A nice little Honda shot. Um, I'm going inside. I don't know what I could even do. There's just, there ain't nothing. You had to go and do it, huh? I know, I had to rip my had to go and do tendon it. off the muscle. It sucks. Ha, ha, ha.